Good afternoon, this is Simon from Prestige Garden Services and we're currently on a site, just literally from one site to another uh, at a client's where we are, uh, well we're effectively resurfacing a, uh, an area within the back of the garden that is, uh, it's been basically in poor condition due to water and drainage and that of decking and floor and as you can see as I'm just coming around the corner here, surprising probably the lads can hear them busy working away, uh, we are completely re surfacing and excavating and uh, effectively improving the lay of the land here so i'm gonna take you around this is andy and uh and chris how are you doing not bad good good how's it going today not too bad enjoying the weather yeah i'm glad it's come out it's really cold this morning it was right let's have a look around and let's tell you what's been happening so on this particular property We've had a, a beautiful wood decking area here that's currently uh, in need of some, some repair, but it's, it's a fabulous decking uh, design and it's got some beautiful glass panels in it. Uh, clearly, as we're exposed to the elements of the weather, we can see clearly by just inspecting the wood that it's suffered some, uh, some wood rot and some damage, and that happens obviously with water. Once we've obviously taken up the actual deckings, you can see the areas of concern. What is good to see though is a, a quality membrane down here, which effectively stops the weeds coming through. This is a very, very well built decking structure uh, with lots and lots of posts, battens to create a very, very good structure. So you're not getting effectively a, tr a trampoline effect once you uh, step on it. Now then, this has already obviously been laid down and what we'll be doing is we'll be actually resurfacing and re-leveling uh, some of the areas. You can see some of the actual broken wood and damage to the wood, uh, which basically is rotten wood areas of concern. And what the major issue here has been is the, the effect of the water. So we've had a, a walkway coming down here, which effectively is, is old slabs, which I think the lads have crashed, uh, sorry, crunched up and, uh, and removed. Some of it tried to probably retain for be, to be resourceful, as you can see here. These flags, very, very old. Uh, and over a period of time, the pointing within it softens, releases, it effectively turns into uh, debris and the water can get through the cracks and that's what's happened obviously in this area here so we've got a lot of drainage issues in respect to very, being very very, un, uh, very messy very wet and then obviously what you then get with the tiles it gets very unbalanced and starts to raise and drop in other areas and with the clients that we have in the property I was just concerned and they were concerned about effectively trips and falls coming out of a step that's quite high down to a level where obviously you've got the water there you've got residue in respect to algae, moss, it causes obviously a very slippy surface. So health and safety is a must and is obviously a concern. So this is Ruth and Mike's property who I get on very well with. Hope you're having a nice holiday Ruth and Mike. Hope you're uh, enjoying the, uh, the state of your garden whilst you're away. This is what's going on at the moment. So Chris and Andy have been effectively taking up the, uh, the lower level, all the brickwork in regards to the, uh, the stones. I come right around the corner where we've obviously exposed the areas. You can start to see now what we were talking about before in respect to the actual levelling. Uh, you can see the bumps, how it raise. Uh, it's, it's, there's, there's a lot basically going on in respect to the, the surface and you've just got to be mindful of the facts. So what we're doing is we're effectively building up, removing and implementing a completely new surface for them to come out off the deck, off both the front door and the right hand side of the deck in regards to a nice clean finish. And we're extending right round to the back of the garden up to this heavy plant sorry, heavy bush, and we're using sleepers. Sleepers have been cemented into the corners. You can see that the wood will, uh, once it's dry, obviously with wet, with water, and with a mix of cement, cement uh, it effectively when it dries, it draws the, uh, the water out of the wood and it bonds it together. So it'll be a very, 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 very solid fix uh, in respect to that. Sawing away, cutting away, preparing all the wood battens today in around this area and preparing, effectively speaking, a new decking area Oops, for, uh, for the, uh, the clients to walk out safely and it marries up with what they've got on the right hand side. So we'll be, ma we'll be marrying up the wood from the left hand side to the right hand side. You can see there's a bit of a, a slope here now coming forward. This will be built up with soil and have a more of a flush area in respect to the actual lawn. Uh, and effectively speaking, in two or three days time, this will look like an incredible ship. Uh, it'll look incredible. It'll look fabulous in respect to the, uh, the contrast between the wood, the grass, the decking. And it's the kind of business that we do all, the, all, all, all year round. Uh, and certainly we've got the weather today. It's just a, a main concern, obviously, was the water and that of uh, the drainage. Now, we had some... Uh, where are those drainage? There they are. 
There we are. We've got some drainage to install as well down the right hand side of the property. That of water, you've got to be, be very conscious of water in building uh, because of the fact that if it's not done correctly, the water will just drain. It can sit on tops of wood. It won't drain away properly. And we see that every single, well, not every single day, but certainly every week I get inquiries about wood uh, resurfacing, water damage. It's effectively the drainage on, uh, on decking uh, and specs that we see quite regularly. If it isn't done correctly, uh, then it's a, not a waste of money, but certainly it's something you have to come back to and repair. So we do resurfacing, we do new decks, we do uh, extensions, a whole host of different particular work. So the drainage, we're going down the left-hand side, so the water falls off the actual property, hits the deck, it'll have somewhere to go to. If it doesn't have anywhere to go to, it'll just sit on the top. Clearly the decking has got gaps for it to go through, but with the downpours that we've been having recently, we can't legislate for the amount of water, so it's better to plan ahead. You can see now the guys are clearly uh, very, 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 very carefully preparing and organising in the level of where they're going to start the deck. So that's it. That's where we are at the moment in the back of a property. It's the kind of stuff that we do all year round from commercial residential. Should you need any further information from Simon or any of the team at Prestige, please get in touch. Send me an email, simon at prestigegardenservices.com or contact us on Facebook under Prestige Garden Services. Hope you're having a nice day wherever you are. From Simon, Andy and Chris, have a good day.